Hello, girl. What an awesome way to continue our morning. It really has been a beautiful day, yeah? She's sniffing the ground. I think she might have left her cub here. She's not... At first I thought she was calling. She's not. The picture of elegance. I think she's hunting. She looks quite full belly to me. There's that twitchy tail. It sticks out so clearly when you're watching a leopard. Such a cool morning. So many things have just gone right this morning. It's awesome. There's nothing like a, a surprise leopard. on everybody and while we sneak through here and figure out where shadow is going Michael wants to know if our leopards ever hunt monkeys or baboons in this area in the way that they do in other places yes they absolutely do the last or the second to last time that I saw Shadow with her cub, she had a monkey carcass. The little baby was chewing on the monkey's head. Karula's been known to catch monkeys before, and Kunuma has caught a baboon. So yes, absolutely, our leopards are. That's one of the reasons why monkeys go so incredibly frantic when they see leopards. They know that it's one of the few animals, apart from birds of prey, that are threats to them and that would be capable of catching them in the trees that they climb in. Only animal agile enough. And monkeys and, oh sorry, baboons and leopards, even more so. And baboons and leopards have been known to have out and out wars with each other because a big male baboon is about half the size of a female leopard or half the size and weight of a female leopard. However, I'm sure she's going to go straight towards that termite mound. However, there are lots of big male baboons in a troop and they have been known on occasion to come to blows with leopards of an area. I was just about to pick up my game drive comms. I haven't had a chance to call this in or establish which way she's going. She goes onto the termite mound. Let's catch up with her. Oh, there's no better picture than a leopard on a termite mound in the morning sunlight. This station's one Mufazi Ingwe to the south of Balanites between Zoe's and Triple M. Approaching the repeater, but we're in some thick bush here. As soon as I get to exactly where we are, I'll keep you updated. She's mobile north. Surveying the area. These termite mounds are so, so useful, which is why we so often see our leopards moving up onto one. Just because gives them a vantage point over the area that they're in, chance to look for any prey. She's not in luck though. I don't think it was her calling, causing the alarm calls. Because she's come straight back to the area where we first had them and all of the animals have disappeared from here. Let's go around the other side, get her in the morning light. Hmm. I say that. Not as, not as easy to do without driving right into her personal space, which I don't want to do. It should be relatively easy to do once we just get past these bushes.
No, it's not going to be as easy as I thought.